Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of The Long Dark. Uh, picking up right where we left off here, uh, we made our way to the gas station here, refilled on some supplies, uh, mainly much-needed food. Uh, we met this guy, uh, met Husla, <laughs> met Husla. Uh, I, I assume that's how he says his name, but we stole all of his food and just basically left him to die. Uh, so with that, let's go ahead and get the heck out of here. Man, this is so weird. It's... It, for some reason, the game almost takes, like, a screenshot of when you enter a building, and then when you leave it, it shows the screenshot again. I'm not really too sure what the, uh, the, the intention behind that is, but it seems to happen with every building. It's very weird. Um, hopefully we don't get eaten. Uh, that would be terrible. <laughs> there, is, there was a wolf out here, uh, that just snagged, like, a, uh, ten foot, uh, ten point buck over there yonder. Uh, it looks like he's walking away from it. We might be able to go snag some... If he walks away from it, we might be able to go, like, snag some, uh, some food off of him. Let's just take it very slow and see what, like, see what he does. Did he have his fill? And he's like, I'm good. It's a lone wolf. Oh, there's another buck out there. He might be going for that buck. Let's... Let's watch. I wish I could do like a David Attenborough. Let's watch as the wolf travels. There's a there's definitely a buck out there that I think he's going for. Okay, well, bye. Hopefully at some point we can kill some wolves. Not that you should kill any wolves. I got enough stones. Uh, God, that's scary. That is so scary just hearing wolves. And I have nothing to defend myself with. Uh, it's getting pretty late. We need to get back to the Great Mother's house ASAP. And hopefully not get eaten by any wolves. I assume that wolves do come into the town here. So I gotta I gotta keep my head on a swivel. Oh, you can actually search cars. Oh, uh, cars, like, act, act, uh, you can, like, get in them. They're probably, like, safe things. Milton Hidden Cash Note. Uh, a note found discarded. Uh, hey, girl. <laughs> hey, girl. That grumpy jer a jerk at Orca left the back door open, so I snuck in and took some stuff. I thought we might need it for when we get out of here. I can't wait to get over to the mainland with you, uh, where we can finally be together f for real. Uh, I'll meet you there tomorrow night like we planned. I stashed this stuff near the big fallen tree in the marshy area behind St. Christopher's. You know, where we met that one time and drank your, dad, uh, your dad's contraband. Okay, cool. So, St. Christopher's is the church. Let's go ahead and take that. Ah, oh, cool. So, there's a, uh, a hidden supply cache. As we just learned... Uh, St. Christopher's is quite a hike. It's over this way. I'm glad that I, uh, I'm glad that that actually adds to my, uh, adds to my map. So I don't really have to remember it, I guess. Um, I'm not really interested in checking out some of the houses. We're pretty good on supplies for the time being. So we're gonna go complete the, uh, the Grey Mother quest, I guess. Dude, the, just hearing the wolves just scares the heck out of me, dude. Like, where's the wolves? It's like, it's so... It's brut... It's brutal already. It's brutal enough that we have to survive, like, the cold and hunger and thirst and everything else. I didn't recognize that blood spot there. 
Oh, did they kill the Grey Mother? Oh, I did not realize this before. This is the area that we came from. This is how we got into the house. So that guy is a frozen corpse. You know what? Looking at this guy, it looks like he has, like, an orange jumpsuit. Almost like he was a prisoner and the prisoners, like, got out. I wonder if that's a thing. That's kind of interesting. But, like, the blood comes from the doorstep of the Grey Mother's house. So, Grey Mother killed him and dragged his body out there? That might be an interesting development. Maybe the, the uh... Maybe, uh, the Grey Mother is the bad, the bad man's. <laughs> Uh, doubtful, but you never know. Uh, cat tail head. Uh, cat tail head. Yep, I said that right. <laughs> Let's go ahead and uh, put some more stuff in here. Um, right. We need point four one more stuff. <laughs> Let's put the sticks in there. Is that good enough? Okay, so in the bridge as well, we got some food, which is great, because I think we can sleep, and I think that might be able... I'm not really sure how to get my health up, to be honest. I thought we could, like, heal ourselves by sleeping, but... Perhaps not. Great mother! Good news! <laughs> I brought some food. Um, okay, also, by the way, last episode I had mentioned that, uh... Maybe there's something that we need to do with these rabbit carcasses um, in order to, like, cook them. So let's check that out and see if there's... Because, I don't know, maybe we need to, like, harvest it. <laughs> like, get some meat off of it or something like that. I don't know. I feel like we should be able to eat it, but... Just eat it. Just eat it. Where's the rabbit carcass? Eat it. Ah, harvest. Okay. Okay. All right, okay, here we go. Meat, hide, guts. <laughs> uh, it's it's going to take one hour and nine minutes to do all of this. It's a small little rabbit. Are the calories all that, like, really all that worth it? I'd assume at some point we could get, like, a better, like, harvesting tool. Okay, so we got some pelts. Cool, okay. Oh, nice. Okay, so we do have some uh, fresh rabbit meat. So we'll go ahead and harvest this fella, this little fella as well. I guess we'll do everything while our food's good. We need to... I'm trying to really kind of manage my my stuff. Oh, it's getting dark. Ooh, spooky. <laughs> uh, okay, so... I'm going to take this unsafe water and grab it. And I'm going to drop that, I think. Stale chocolate bar. We'll keep that. New dog food. Bang up dog food. Can I repair the dog food? <laughs> uh, I'm going to store the good stuff and, like, eat the bad stuff first. I don't know if that's, like, a sound strategy or not. Oh, not advised. <laughs> not advised, I guess. Can this hold more stuff? I don't know if I can or not. Um, okay. So that... Will it create another row? It does create more rows. It dynamically creates more rows. That is fantastic. Good news, everyone. Why is this house so dark? Okay, so... Hmm. Well, we can get, like, water... I think any time, kinda. Hey, I did your bidding. Oh, do I gotta fit... I gotta put more food in here? I can't even see your fridge. Hey, I'm gonna... I'm gonna go hit the hay. Are the stairs here? Right. I don't know how I'm doing this. The bed should be the... Oh, now I'm lost. Oh, this is not good. <laughs> Who 
Oops. The bed should be right here. Oh, you know what? No, it's not. I'm in a cupboard. Oh, for Christ. Ah, <laughs> uh, this sucks. Oh, I cannot start a campfire. Can I not do a torch? Do I not have a torch? Ah, I was in the bathroom. I was in the bathroom, guys. Sorry. Oh! <gasps> I lit the bed on fire! No! <laughs> Alright, uh, let's sleep. Yeah, let's get a good, like... Eh, let's sleep in a little bit. Why not? <laughs> let's see if that... Let's see what effect that has on my health. And we'll go put some more food. Uh, I wonder if the, uh... Okay, so I just slept, like, nine hours, man. Uh, think about his food. I hate to keep like lighting these. All right, I just need a little like. I slept nine hours, but it's still nighttime. You guys ever do that? You like sleep so long that it like becomes nighttime. <laughs> I guess basically what I'm asking you, have you guys ever been in a coma? <laughs> Alright, so I slept. Um, I slept a long time. Did I put all my stuff in here? No, I got some cattails. Uh, no, I don't want any accelerant. That's only going to last eight minutes, but that's... Like, let's just get it going, I guess. Just to get some freaking light in this stupid house. I might have to go back to bed. I came down for a night. I, I thought it was already nighttime. Sleeping nine hours, it would make it like daytime. Pretty well. What an idiot I am. Okay, I also have some coal. That did not provide as much light as I thought it was going to provide. All right, I guess let's put some more stuff in here. Right? Keep the water on me. I want to dr... I, I don't know if I can cook that that or not. Ah, return to the Great Mother. Okay, cool. Um, let's do our inventory real quick. And drop all of that. Alright, let's go to the Great Mother, see what she has to say. Friend, <laughs> old man. On the way into town, there was an old man. Glasses, big beard, walking stick. He seemed uh, a little odd. Doesn't sound like anyone from Milton. Most of the elderly have gone or died. I'm the only one left. The only one from the old. I wonder, okay, that's kind of weird, so, what, who, who was the man that I just referenced? Was he the guy in the gas station, or was it the guy in, that was up by the radio tower that was frozen to death, or are we talking, uh, it's not the guy in the shed, because the shed, the guy in the shed had no beard and he was completely bald, so. The old man outside of town, Methuselah, he said he'd seen other people walking towards Milton. Other outsiders? It's possible. Where would they be? Maybe my friend was with them. If they were outsiders, they might have stayed in the old schoolhouse. In the months after the quakes, people used to huddle there for the warmth of the school's old coal burner. Rare outsider coming through Milton might stay there the night. If your friend came through Milton, Chances are she ended up there. Okay, so now I'm really confused because we just referenced another old man that we saw coming into town, but I don't, I can't recall another old man that came into town. Was it the guy, I guess it must have been the guy that we saw frozen to death up by the, the radio tower. That's the only, that's the only one that I can think of that 
we would be referencing because we just referenced the dude Methula, Methula uh, in the uh, in the gas station. So this other guy that we saw coming into town must have been somebody else, and it must have been the guy up by the the radio tower because that's the only person that. I would know of, but didn't we just say that we saw him walking into town? So that doesn't make any sense. So we didn't see anybody. I don't understand that. I maybe I'm maybe I missed something. Have you been able to remember anything else about that night? Anything that might help me find my friend? I'm back in that night. Wind howling. Voices passing through town. I can hear them. Just outside the window. It's windy. But the voices carry. They are yelling. Her voice, it passes through town. She's running. She's alone, calling for help. But no one comes. Why didn't anyone help her? Yes. Why didn't they? They should have. They should have found her before it was too late. Anything else you can remember might help. They said men came from the tunnel. What about the tunnel? The only way out of Melton. The only way through the mountains. It's the only way she could have gone. Hmm. Okay, so we got. I guess we gotta find the uh, the tunnel. She also like dropped her gun as well. Can I have your gun, please? Okay, apparently I can't have the gun. Are you done with the gun? Because I could really use the gun. No? No gun? Okay. Um, so it looks like it's still dark outside, for sure. Um, let's see if we can cook some stuff really quick. Because I am a little hungry. How about the rabbit meat? Gamey rabbit. Can I not take this? I'm pressing transfer. I can't take the rabbit, though. I can take, like, the other stuff. Oh, no, I can't take the other stuff. Why can't I take the other stuff? This is so weird. I don't know what's going on. That's dog food. I'm not sure what's going on here, but I'm not, like... I can click some stuff. I can take some stuff and transfer it. Some stuff I can't, though. So I wonder why that is. I'm trying to use this fire to cook that rabbit meat. What am I even eating? Mmm, <laughs> delicious. Pinnacle peaches. I'll take it. Okay, get my hunger on. This is so weird. This, uh, this is frustrating now. I want to take... I want to take this, but it's not letting me. I am clicking the A button. You guys hear that? I'm hitting it. <laughs> For some reason, it's just... It's not coming. But see, I can take that stuff. That's weird. But I can't take that. Like, is it because I'm like... I, I have no idea. I'm so confused why I can't take and cook this. It doesn't make much sense. I don't know why that's blocking me. Why is that blocking me? Huh. And I can't take the peaches either. Why? Why, how come? <laughs> I have no idea why, why, how come? Why, how come? Oh, my light's out. Okay, well, let's eat some sardines. I wonder if you can cook these, actually. And get that up. I wish there was a bed, like, by the fire. That'd be... Hecka cool, man. Uh, let's go ahead and just pass time. Because we're already, like, well rested up. So let's pass time. Let's just hang out with, uh... This lady. It's almost... Uh, sun's coming up. Let's just wait, like... Two hours and see what happens. Got full health, though. That's cool. 
Ah, sun's coming up. Great. Morning. Uh, winter forecast. Weather warning. Heavy snow and record low temperatures expected. Scrawled in handwriting below. She won't like it one bit, but we'll need to check on her. Someone has to. Okay, interesting. It looks like that's coming from the, the town folk. Add extra fuel to grandmother's uh, wood bin. What? <laughs> what? Really? That's what I gotta do? Okay, so we're gonna do that, I guess. Alright, let's, um... Here's what I wanna do. I wanna go check out that uh, cache at the, uh, at the church. So let's do that, and then we'll call it a day. Hopefully I don't need to, like, break into anything. Oh, man. Oh, boy. I can't even find a bed. I'm sure there's some sort of, like, lantern at some point, but I need a weapon. I need a way to defend myself against these uh, against these wolves, but, you know, I can definitely understand the game mechanic of not giving the player, like, a weapon, like, right off the bat. Like, it's definitely, like, scary AF. <laughs> it's definitely terrifying. Did we already try to get into the credit union? Over here? What does this note say? Dear members, due to global economic rea realities that are well known to you, we are unfortunately unable to remain in operation. All banking services are hereby suspended until further notice. We'll go ahead and take that for our journal. Let's go and check this place out, see if there's anything in here. Keep an eye on your scent indicator when carrying raw meat or fish. Okay, interesting. I, why can't I break into those candies? I can eat some candy, right? Uh, do we want cloth? Yeah, let's take some cloth for some bandages. I think that's important. Usually in these type of games, I am definitely like a hoarder. Like definitely in like Fallout, I have trouble playing Fallout because I just like to pick up everything. But this game, you got to really... You gotta really manage your um, inventory, or else you're gonna get you're gonna get yourself some strained ankles. You know what I'm saying? That's a big ass drawer. Damn. I'll take that. Nothing. Nothing. At least, at least I got some. At least the uh, sodas and drinks stay cool in this environment. Ooh, what was that? Metal chair. We need a hacksaw. Need a hacksaw Jim Duggan. Ho! <laughs> Alright, nobody understands that joke, I guess. I'm sure, a lot, I'm sure some of you do. Well, there's nobody around here, so um, uh, it's ours. Antibiotics, take it. Need it. Because we might have to start drinking out of toilets. <laughs> that might be the case at some point here. Ooh, okay, we'll take that, because I think we can actually break down clothing items. I think we can... Aw, oh, damn it, I need a pry bar. Hope I can still eat this. Baller. Okay, we're getting some food. That's the second part of the, the test here. Also, I'm not really thrilled that I have to open each drawer in the filing cabinet. I wish I could do it all at once, but it, it is what it is. I see you. I'll take that. This will come in handy. Oh, tea. Oh, cup of coffee. Uh, take it. I don't think I need it right now. But thanks for putting your coffee in there. Nice little iced coffee, I guess, by now. Locked. Can't get in here yet. Huh. Alright, we're figuring this out. It was what? It was like in the 40s.
Uh huh. Okay. So we got what? 38? 38. Remember that, guys. <laughs> Come on now. Ah, thirty eight, um, thirty eight fifty four, thirty eight fifty four. Ah, shoot, it was like six. All right, uh, thirty eight fifty four and like six. Oh, I forget how you do these. It's been a while since I've done a lock. 38. 54. And I think it's like 6. Come to daddy. <laughs> a stack of papers? What? That's it? We got a book. Alright, take it. I think I can use this. Cash money. Canada. $20. Pretty much worthless these days. Uh, useful as Tinder. I'm rich! <laughs> I'm the richest man in all of Milton. A lot of papers, a lot of like fire stuff. Ah, if only we got the uh, the bank vault code. Where would that be though? Locked. Can't get in here yet. I'd assume that we would be around here somewhere, right? Hang on a tick. Is it in the bathroom? <laughs> Do they keep the codes in the bathroom? It's gotta be in the office, right? That's what that's my initial thought. Is that it's in the it's gotta be in like this office somewhere. I don't know, maybe it's somewhere else. We already did that, though. Oh, we didn't check this place. Right. Bank manager's house key. Bank manager's house key will unlock one of the houses in Milton. Okay, we're taking that. Bank manager's house. And that's where we'll find the code. Absolutely, that's where we're going to find the code. Whenever we, whenever we come across the, uh, the bank manager's house. It's got to be in there. All right, guys. I think I'm going to abandon uh, going to the, uh, the cache uh, behind the church today. Uh, we're already, like, hitting 30 minutes on this episode, so I, I want to keep it neat and tidy uh, for the most part. Um, so, yeah, so uh, let's just go back to the Grey Mother's house and drop off some more uh, tinder and firewood and, and whatnot and maybe some food. Get that quest done. <laughs> There's a side quest to do that now. Maybe at some point she'll be gracious enough to give us our, our damn weapon. You old lady... All right, let's, uh, I'm keeping all, I think I want to keep all the matches. Cattail head, what do we got? Let's just put everything in. Let's just put everything in. And then we'll just take everything out. Right, so we'll complete that, and then we could we should be able to should be able to take it out then, right? Huh? 
Okay, well, uh, never mind. Uh, let's go ahead and grab some stuff out of here, then. <laughs> and hopefully I don't run into the same issues where I can't, uh, take anything out. Let's grab the, uh, well, let's grab more than that, shall we? Grab that. Um, let's grab... Let's grab the reclaimed wood. I can't, see? I For some reason, I can't grab that stuff, and I'm not sure why. Uh, if you guys know why I can't do that, please let me know in the comments below. I'm, I'm kind of getting annoyed that I can't, like, pick stuff up, and I'm not... I, I'm not entirely, entirely sure why. I wonder if picking that stuff up... What the hell was that? You guys hear that? <laughs> I can't love... For some reason, I just can't pick stuff up, and it's annoying me. Um... Like, I don't think it would over-encumber me. You know? Alright, cool. Well, anyway, guys, next episode, uh, we're gonna try to head to the, to the church. Who knows what we're gonna run into? Uh, also, by the way, looking at the sky, that's hecka cool, man. I like the, uh, it's almost like watercolor, like, skybox, and that's pretty neat. I really enjoy it. Um, alright, guys, well, uh, wow, I just had, like, the biggest brain fart of all times. Alright, that's where I'm gonna leave things off, guys. Uh, thank you so much for watching this episode. Please definitely leave a like and a comment below. And while you're at it, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you guys are not subscribed already. I do put out daily gaming videos, so be sure to do that so you don't miss anything. And I'll see you guys on the next episode.